So I just got the secret star from the peach slide, and I have 30 stars now. Do moving on pretty well. That's one fourth the way down with this walkthrough. And right now, I'm gonna go complete the last. Wait, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna go complete the uh, the last star and the booze haunted haunt 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 haunt. So we're gonna pound this boot. Come on. All right, no play games. No more playing games here. There we go. Give me the carousel looking thing. So we're gonna dive in here and we're gonna get eye to the eye in the secret room. You need the invisible cap, uh, the, or the vanish cap, excuse me, to get this star. So just head right in here. Go up the steps. And this one can be pretty tricky. You have to be pretty quick and fleet on your foot. And the launch across here. I'm gonna jump. Come on. Get under the box. Wait, no. Yeah, that's right, right, right. I was just checking which room I was making sure I was going in the correct direction. Alright, so get the cap. Oh, come on. Thank you. That might cost me. That might cost... What am I doing? Did not mean to go in that door. Let's go. Uh, it's pretty much over. I need to get the cap again. Yeah, that's not happening. So I gotta get the cap again. Uh, what you have to do, you probably got a glimpse of what I had to do there. You have to get the cap, you have to launch yourself, just catapult yourself across. Uh, I don't even know where to get those hops from. I mean, maybe Italian people will be the next studs in the NBA. I know some guys played in Italy for basketball. So I need to get the cap one freaking more time. I am slow as molasses today. Mario, it's like Ray Charles bouncing off the walls, except he's invisible. Can't even see anything. I mean, Mario's eyes, I mean... It looked like, be looked like little beans on his eyes. Okay, so... Once you get through this door, jump over where this boo sign type thing is. And you have a mean, a huge eye! A huge eye! Don't go through there! Alright. You're gonna be met with a huge eye. Just run around in circles like you usually do when you're... Oh, okay. Don't run into it, though. Like you usually do when you got an eye around you. Just run around it. And it will... Whatever, disintegrate or evaporate. I don't know what that really is. I mean, just vanish, I guess, because it's the vanish cap. So that is the 34th star and the last normal star in Big Boo's haunt. And of course, five. So we're going to be moving on to the sixth course now. Which is a good one. I like the sixth course. I especially like the music. It is Hazy Maze Cave, and you need uh, the Bowser uh, key to unlock the rest of these stages. I believe, what is it, 6 through 9. 6 through 9, I believe, are, you, you need the first Bowser key to unlock. So the bunny should be in here, Mr. Alice in Wonderland. So I'm going to give him a couple chases. I probably won't catch him the first time around. This bugger just drives me insane. He goes everywhere. It's probably the most frustrating star for me. Surprise me. No, I'm not kidding. Just, just kidding. Just kidding. So you want to jump in this door, uh, which uh, is elevated. And there is a toad, mini invisible toad over here that you want to talk to. Somewhat transparent. And he will give you a star. There are three toads in Peach's Castle that will give you a star. And the easiest stars in the game, I gotta tell you, they're pretty secret, but quite easy if you figure it out, if you uh, learn about them. So we're at 32 already, and we're gonna jump in this pool of metallicness. And we have to go meet the swimming beast in the cavern, which I have given the name Nessie. Because anything resembling Nessie deserves much praise because the Loch Ness Monster is possibly the most amazing creature in the world. Uh, hands down. And I look it looks like there's a Zubat all the way across over there. Thought I was done with the Zubats. But apparently they're coming back. And they get somewhat of an Aerodos as well in those spiders that roam around here. But gotta love this this music. It's nice and like feel like you're a, oh I'm gonna uh, feel, you feel like you're um and by the way this is the star I just decided to do haphazardly uh, you can do wall kicks over here right past those rolling rocks you just do simple wall kicks and this is actually the sixth star in this place it's the easiest sixth star you've ever seen in your life um, so just do a couple wall kicks uh, once you get past those rolling rocks as it says and you got yourself a star so this time for reels we're gonna be taking on Nessie and guiding that that uh, 
beautiful Zyasaur to our star. So once again, we're going to launch ourselves over here. Forget about the Zubats. I don't want to see you. Get out of here. At least be Golbats. I mean, Zubats, seriously. I mean, when, when your best move is supersonic, I mean, something's wrong. Probably not, but, you know. So you want to take this elevator down. You see you got a tempting star over there, but we're not going to be getting that right now. So what I like to do is I like to launch myself down here. No need to. You got water right here, so there's no need to really preserve all of your energy. Swim over to the beast. We cannot find it yet. Nessie is hiding from us. Where could that Poseidon be? Where could you be, Nessie? Are you slowing me up in the water? You know, oh, there it is. So, it looks all docile. It really doesn't do anything to you. I wish it just started going on a rampage and just... Orca whaled me all the way back to, uh... Uh, uh um... SeaWorld. So what you want to do is whatever... Oh my gosh, I have no control on this D-pad. You want to uh, guide Nessie by whatever direction you are facing. Uh, it will turn its body and start going that way. You have to turn your body simultaneously uh, because its head and body will just be jumping all over the place. No, 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 no! Terrible camera angle at the last second there. Thank you, Lakutu. Oh, I forgot how to say your name. See, that's what you get when you don't give me good camera angles. I forget how to say your name. And that is one of the most just embarrassing things to do, but I'm not embarrassed to do it. So you just jump up on this platform. You have a couple uh, coins. And why are you freaking lagging? So there is the first real star in the order for the Hazy Maze Cave. Not too, not too difficult whatsoever. Just got to know which direction you're going. That's half the battle in this uh, place. I bet the creators kind of made it. They're like, it's a maze. We don't have to make the stars very difficult. Uh, they should have made them a little bit more difficult. It's very easy stars. Uh, although it is a sixth mission, or sixth course, excuse me. Play too much Age of Empires. Um, so, I guess not going to be that difficult. Anyways, get away from me, rolling rocks. Now the Rolling Stones is coming through. Mick Jagger. Uh, what was I saying? Anyways, all the courses up to like the 10th course are really easy anyways. I mean, pretty much every course is easy except Rainbow, uh, the Rainbow uh, Ride one. I mean, that thing's just devilish. So what I'm going to doing now, you guys are probably thinking, this is not how you get the 8 red coins. Well, I'm going to be getting the metal cap right now because I feel like getting the metal cap and I want to listen to that sick nasty music that it plays when you get the metal cap anyways. So what you want to do is you want to get on Nessie once more. It's going to be our last meeting with Nessie until Mario Party because Mar it makes a guest appearance in Mario Party and stop spinning me around Nessie! I appreciate the ride but you're giving me seasickness already and I'm Mario and I'm Italian. I am Magellan. I am Magellan. No, not Dr. Scholl's commercials. I am Magellan. The Explorer. So, once again, you got to direct Nessie correctly, and I'm apparently doing a terrible job of it. I would probably be crashing, crashing a cruise ship somewhere, somewhere at this point if I were driving a ship. But, good thing I won't be doing that. I will probably only be restricted to driving pontoon boats, unfortunately. Oh gosh, I meant to do the long jump, but I did the uh, the famous ground pound instead. Right on its back. It just squeals. I love hearing Nessie squeal. But there will be another star that you're going to have to get. You can see uh, there's a switch right there. We'll get to that later. Not now. i got to worry about getting that freaking metal cap. And once we get that metal cap, we can go back to Dire Dire Docks and take care of some unfinished business there. So you're going to jump across, go through these metal doors. And you gotta do a couple careful long jumps. Wait, excuse me, what am I thinking? I'm thinking of the other star. Launch yourself into some more metallicness. And you're Metal Mario! Listen to the great music that they, ma they made for this cap. Take out those guys, I don't know their specific name. And you can get the 8 red coin star as long as along with the metal cap switch. Um, you have to be, in order to stay in the same spot in the water, you're gonna need the metal cap in this area because the water will just sweep you away in the violent current. There we go. 
Okay, so you gotta be careful now since... Oh, my gosh. Make sure you get on... There we go. We're fine. Uh, but make sure that you... You can get the eight red coins very easily if you have the metal cap with you underwater. And the coins are very easy to get. So we got one and two right there. There are two more suspended in air on land. So I'm gonna hit the switch after I get these coins. Which will allow us to use the metal cap in this little area as well to get the other coins. And I believe it's right over here. There we go. Get this, this cap, get underwater, collect ourselves the, the other four coins, which are basically all in a circle right here. Very easy. And the star is on the other side of this right there. You can see it. So we're going to jump in there, get our 35th star. So what do we make? What, what, how many stars do we get? Four stars in this video? I can't remember. I believe that's something like that. But thanks for watching this part. I believe this is part 11 for real. And I will see you guys later. We'll take on more in Hazy Maze Cave and Dire Dark.